Hi, this is Mans from Quest for a Farm, and today we are going to really, really quickly be preserving garlic. So, basically, so far, I have just peeled it and washed it. I haven't bothered taking these little stem bits off it. I've got a used coffee container, which obviously I have cleaned up, and outside on the stove, I've just got some spirit vinegar, just plain vinegar boiling. So washed it, dried it, and now I just need to pack it. So any of the garlic that doesn't fit in here, I'll probably just mince up and freeze. Oh, there's a little piece of skin still. Tut, tut, tut. Mm, I don't know if that will fit. Okay, take that last piece of skin off. Get off skin. I hate peeling garlic. I hate it. I am not the most graceful creature on land. Huh. Or in the water for that matter. Alright, so let me show you what comes next. This last bit of garlic, as I say, this little, last little bit, is going to just get chopped up and put in the fridge. We go through enough garlic that it'll probably last no problem. I've got a couple of fresh cloves as well. Okay, so I have got my pot <coughs> of vinegar from outside. Let me use my brain and funnel it in nicely. And then just carefully pouring so it settles in and doesn't come spilling over the top but you do want to make sure it's all covered there you go so we just give it a tap 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 we want to get all those air bubbles out if you're using a more intelligent jar then you are more than welcome to use a debubbling stick it just wouldn't work particularly well in this and that's it so I'm gonna just close her up and let it come down to room temperature and then we have this really cute little gar jar of preserved garlic easy Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. I changed my mind. I actually used the last of my vinegar. I remembered I had this wee tiny little bottle. So I just chucked the last few little cloves of garlic that I had into this bottle. And then there's no risk of it going off. Okay, I just needed to add an addendum to the garlic video. So, I don't know if you can see here, but my garlic cloves started looking like little blue <laughs> smooths in the bottle. And I panicked, I'm not going to lie. So, after a bit of quick research, it is absolutely fine. In fact, it's quite normal. It is just the garlic itself reacting to the acidic environment of the video. So, it will not change the taste and it will not affect the longevity of your garlic. So don't panic if it turns into Smurfs.